Hi guys. My little sister wanted to say hi and I'm gonna get this video started by saying that you can get the templates at my blog and I'll put the link in the description box. And I basically started out by making the nachos and they are a mixture of tan, yellow, and translucent clay. I also mix black sand or you can mix black pepper into the clay to make it look more like tortilla chips. You put it in the bowl. She really wants to help out. So to make the nacho cheese, I mix Dimensional Magic and acrylic paint together. And it's a lot easier than using Fimo Deco Gel or resin because it dries really fast and you don't have to bake it. I bake the chips in the little paper tray and the paper tray doesn't burn. And then once it was baked and cooled, I added the cheese or the Dimensional Magic and paint. You put it in some cheese on it. I glued the popcorn tub together with a glue stick and all the templates again can be found on my blog, tonyellison.blogspot.com and I'll add a link to the description box below. So basically I just filled up the tub with clay all the way to the top and then I used white clay to make little pieces of popcorn and added them individually to the top until it was overfilling. And then I added yellow and orange chalk to make the popcorn look like it was buttered. For the ices, I just added a little piece of clay to the bottom of the cup to keep everything secure and then I baked it and then I glazed the inside of the cup so that the dimensional magic wouldn't seep through and ruin the color of the paper. And to make the icy, I just mixed dimensional magic and craft sand together. And you just want to mix it until it's a thick consistency. If it's too thin, add more sand and if it's too thick, add more dimensional magic. I use craft sand that I found from Hobby Lobby and it's really useful when you're working with clay because you can mix it in the clay to make the clay look more textured or you can mix it with resin or dimensional magic to add to drinks. I use blue sand to make the blue icy and brown craft sand to make the Coca-Cola icy. And you basically just repeat the same steps, just add sand and dimensional magic and pack it onto the top until you get like a little dome shape. And then one, before they dry, I rolled out some red clay, baked it, and then cut it into little strips to make straws, and then added them to the top of the drinks. The drinks dry really quickly and once they are you can make them make them into charms by adding bezels and gluing them to the back or you can even add head pins. And this is what they all look like once they're finished 
And thanks again for everybody on Instagram for showing me your pictures. I really love looking at them. You guys are so creative, so please keep sending them to me. And I didn't get a chance to add everybody's pictures, so if you make sure you look to see if yours is there, but if you don't see yours, just know that I'm still adding it and still collecting everybody's pictures. So thank you guys so much, and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.